Hello everyone, welcome back to Legit Update family, the world of crypto, the world of free and legit mining and airdrop. Today guys, I want to show you the um, the update on the OES, that is how to bind your wallet address and then how to, that is how, how to the, the withdrawal process on the OES. So I will explain every detail for you guys in this video step by step and then the video might be kind of be a bit long. So. You need to be you know follow up the update and i will tell you guys don't be in a haze that don't hesitate to rush update so i will break everything down for you guys that is the binding of the wallet and then the the withdrawal process of the of the oes so everything will be explained for you guys in this video details by details so you can see now um they say on uh, that is on their x handle they say expressing lower speed on searching their future within the that is OES testnet app. Discover why the OES mainnet is, is a game changing solution we have been waiting for. Dive into our latest article for all the articles. If you notice now, the OES testnet app is very, 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 very slow. Kind of slow. Too slow. So, and I will explain those things for you guys in this video step by step. So, before I continue, I'll show you guys the process on, in this OES. If you're new to the channel or not subscribed before, Click on the red button below and subscribe to the channel for more updates and then click on the bell icon and turn on the notification so that I can drop updates. Get on Facebook I'll see it. So guys, this OES um uh, app is the daily test net is, is finally out on their X handle. So I don't need to you know show you guys the process of downloading the app again. Just need to just throw down small. You throw down small, then you see the they are there so let me just go to my to the how to you know sign up to the to this oes to this allow me to, to show you the you know the, the downloading process it will take a lot of time so let me just go to you know the app and then show you guys the downloading process just like i said just throw down small and then you see the the oes app in the in their x handle so after you have downloaded the oes app on your s handle this is you can see the app this is the say on the sign of the symbol and then they say text net so it's opening so after i finish open you can see where they say sign up and then import so you are not going to sign up or so what i'm going to do is you're going to click on this import so just click on that import so after clicking on that import they'll say you should input your that's your private key so now we are going to get the private key of this the private key the private key they mean is the one that is the wallet you have been using for the test net that is the one you have been using for the quiz what you have been using for the usdt and the swapping so if you are using your metamask you use it so i'm using my metamask in my miss browser so now i'll go to my metamask and then i'll go and get my my private key from there so you need to get your private key you don't need to sign up like i say don't sign up so go and get your private key that is the one you'll be using and then you're going to put it in this section so let me go to my on my meta and then i will explain for you guys how to get your your private key so after you have come to your meta mask you can see my meta mask have about 8.60 usd in my meta mask so you just click on these three lines that is here in your meta mask that this, this is my only the miss browser but in your own meta mask you see a three line there you click the three line that we're going to get the private key then after that you now click on this um this account details so you click on the account details click on that account details so you can see where they say they say show private key so you click on that show private key then they say enter your password so you just put in your password in this section then you now click on confirm now they say who to re to review private key so you're going to hold it and so that your private key will show but i'm not going to show you my private key so i just hold it and then get my private key and go back so, so after you have come back to to the oes app you just click on the import like i see just click on the import then you now put in the your private key that you copy from your metamask and then paste it and then now click on the on the next so they're not there to enter your your wallet that is unlock password so you just put six digits password in this section then you type it two times then after that i click on on done 
So now you can see my 8 8.50 USDT is now showing because I already imported it from my MetaMask to here. So you can see my USDT has come up here, and then you can see my OS. Oh yes. So now you're going to click on this uh, this mission. Let me indicate it. This place they say mission here. Click on that on that mission. So these are the mission you are meant to do. There's mission E, mission X, mission T, mission L, and mission Z. So just click on the mission E first, and then let's try the mission T, the mission E. So now mission E says we should enter our Satoshi that is app email and then our country. So I put my uh, you can see I already put in my email address and then my country which is Nigeria. So now click on on submit. Now you can see now they say error, something went wrong. So the server is kind of down and slow. So it's error. So the server is very, very slow because of a lot of crowd is on the server. So let, let, let's go back. So now, since mission E did not work, let's, okay, let's mission X, mission T, and then mission L. Okay, let's act to save that. Like I told you guys, I said I have no waste time in this, in this video. So let's try mission mission L because you can go about all these other other mission by yourself and take your time and do it. So let's try mission L. So you can see the mission L. They say you need to swap. You need to have some USDT and they need to have OES and they have to have um, AGI. So now if you have USDT now, just in the app this OES testnet app, you can swap it to AGI. Do I've already done it? So if you swap it, everything will take uh, green, green, green. So you can see green, green, red. So you can just swap it in the app if you have some USDT and then, you know, get the AGID. This USDT is just like the testnet USDT. That is, I already showed you how to get the USDT before in my in my video. That is, if you have been following me back to back, you should, you should have known all these things by now. If you're not following me back to back, you might kind of be confused on how to get the USDT and how to swap it. So you can go to the app and then this um this OES app, you see where they say swap. So you just click on the USDT and then... You just click on the on the swap option and to swap to USD for you. So that's how to do the mission mission L. Now this mission Z. Mission Z is the question and answer on the OES. That those questions will ask you answer. So it's like it's compulsory you must do all this mission. So this is like coming to qualify to receive all your coin. So you must do all this all this mission. Now I told you guys I'm going to show you how the withdraw process in the Satoshi app. So now let me go to the Satoshi app and then, you know, there you the, the withdrawal process and when the withdrawal is going to start. Because some of you say the withdrawal is starting on the 20th of uh, that is today, which is not true at all. I don't know where the news came off. Because if you check the Satoshi app, you see where the withdrawal is, where the withdrawal is going to start. And even the Satoshi app carried it. So let me go to my Satoshi app and then show you guys the withdrawal process. Hey, boy, so, hey, boy, don't so, three minutes go. So now you can see this is my Satoshi app. So my Satoshi app is I have about 946 OES in my wallet. So now you just click on this project. That is click on the OES, this plus button that is there. Then it will bring to the or this open ES. You can update your Satoshi app if you have not if you have not just update it to the latest version. So you just click on the open ES. Now you can see the you can see the open ES. This open ES now you can see that the see um the see estimated started see estimated started that is the the mining it started uh 2023 that is April April 4th that's when it started and then the withdrawal is going to start it end on that is on the same April 13 so. So the, is that is just one year mine. That is one year mine. That's I will, I will tell you guys that you, uh, in crypto you can mine for one year, you can mine for more than one year, you can mine for six months. It depends on the project. So you can see where this one started on that is April 13, ending by April 13, which is next month. So anybody that I say we draw starting is not starting this March. It's starting by April, and I'll put you guys through on the on the withdrawal process. So that's how I tell you guys: don't rush updates. Always take your time and then wait for the main update for you before you go into the updates itself now let's go back to the to, uh, let's go back to the satoshi app and then check the satoshi satoshi news because satoshi news will as well carry the updates because the oes is following satoshi app so there's no way that satoshi the oes is launching 
and Satoshi app will not carry the update and then the withdrawal process. So let's go and confirm from the Satoshi app if if the withdrawal process is starting by the 13th of this um this of April. That is on 13. So let's go to the Satoshi news. So you know you can see that this is Satoshi news. Then if you go to your Satoshi app after updating it, you see the, the latest news there. I see OES wallet address submission that is starting by 13th of April to 27th of April. That is the step by step complete guide. I will show you guys those one later. That is on the 13th when the when the um the wallet uh, submission starts because you know that Satoshi app you have to start there was wallet submission before the distribution. You can't withdraw by yourself. It's then that will distribute it to your wallet by them by themselves. So that is the um you know so now you can see the link the link that they sent to this download is okay after the the what they call it that is april that is submission begin that is 13 that is 27 submission end there is a follow link for complete step by step guys so this is the link on how to complete the uh you know how to go about it but i will take my time again like i say and i'll explain for you guys just the way I took my time to explain the OES quiz and then the OES withdrawal process and everything for you guys in my video. So like I always say, follow my video back to back and then do not skip any part of the video. So I always show you guys on how to go about any of the test updates. So don't don't go and be, you know, it's not all, all update that is, you know, genuine. Any update that is not verified is not genuine. So you need to like, you know, update needs to be, needs to be verified before you can, um, before you can, you know, uh, study before you can know what is going on so now this is the verified withdrawal process on the oes so any any withdrawal process they say that you going to start again it will be notified through satoshi app as well and that is the audit for you guys in this video so if you don't understand anything just comment in the comment section below i'll reply to you as much as possible and don't forget to click on the red button and subscribe to the channel for more of this and then click on the bell icon and turn on your notification so that all of this I'm on the first product series. And also don't forget to share the video to other social media platforms and they give the thumbs up. See you guys in my next video. Thank you.